Good morning, America. This is Dr. Cherie. As always, this is my public statement. I'm the first cosmic cop teaching humanity to understand and respect God cosmic design. You know, when Jesus said, don't give pearls to swine, you have no idea how much I really, really connect and feel about it. Since I have tried, since, I don't know, so many times, it takes a lot of chances to go on the FBI and the police private websites and give them my warning. And when I see everything unfolding, wow, it hurts. So because of such a special critical circumstances involving the beating of a young man who died, again, in the hands of reptilian infected cops, I have decided to make this newsletter and this video public. All right, so let's get going. I am going to share uh, the newsletter. The title is pretty clear. What led to Tyre Nichols' death? Please, FBI, police administration, please, please pay attention. And most of all, if you're a supporter of mine, if you know a cop, if you're married to a cop, if you are a cop, please read and share with your friends. That could make a lot of difference between you know, coming back home or not, as simple as it sounds. All right. Now, I have to make sure that you understand that the Rodney King and the George Floyd police brutality cases and countless of others happened under the same very deadly cosmic winds. And unless you dig into my work and pay attention, I will just sound like, you know, another lunatic making a video. Well, my work is so real and so worthwhile. It can actually save lives. You know, even when I went to the, to the FBI website and I give them uh, the opportunity to read everything that happened with Cobra Girls, uh, and including Brian Laundrie killing uh, his girlfriend. Well ahead of time, they still did not budge. The reality is they do not behave like a true detective. And it's, pre it's pretty understandable because my work is so far-fetched. And those guys have been maybe indoctrinated by religion. Now they are talking to the devil, okay? You're not supposed to deal with astrology. It's not astrology, actually. It's astroforensics. But they won't investigate my claim. That's where I am. Meantime, people are dying nonstop because of their reluctance to dig into my work. You all know that if you don't and you're a newcomer, here you go. The FBI visited me twice because I gave very specific dates of terrorist attacks. Just read my experience with those guys. They were kids, maybe 35, 40 years old. And I try to explain how I do it through my software because I'm not a woo-woo. I'm a different scientist. They still didn't get it. I never forget it. Uh, one was born in January and the other one was born in February. All right. And once I'm done, okay, I'll take another chance. I'm going to go there. Okay. I will try to reach those who are in command. You know, those who are safely sitting behind their big desk. Okay. Because they are fully responsible for so many people who suffered an untimely death. Okay, I will submit that newsletter link and the YouTube with it. And I can only hope they ain't going to be harassing me again when I'm trying to help them. Oh, they told me, oh, we know you, Dr. Cherry. We know you very well. So that means they are reading, for God's sake. But why don't they act? Look at this. The obvious, the obvious, the undeniable obvious. Memphis Scorpion Unit inactivated 
and put under review following death of a tire. Now, do you think the police or the FBI elite out there know anything about the current deadly Scorpius dragon cursing the police and society at large? Don't you think you should, for a second, realize that these cosmic winds are so deadly, so revengeful, so bad, so deeply, deeply emotional that the crime is exploding exactly as I wrote in 2021, 22, and 23, as I saw the future through those cosmic winds. The word scorpion is there in God's name. Why don't they take the time to read my predictions and realize and be prepared? Because my warning are very, very real. Okay. The reptilians are after the police, government official through the Avana syndrome and the children or the teen. It's just amazing. And again, he is, he was a teen. God bless his soul. Imagine the pain of a mother losing a child. It's like it happens all the time. I don't want you to be desensitized to this. Doesn't have to happen. There is such a lack of cosmic awareness in all the high places out there. And we, we the people, we are paying the tap. That's going to cost millions and millions and millions of dollars of legal dispute that we, the taxpayer, we are paying. <clears throat> Avana syndrome. Some very, very famous doctors, Dr. Sanchez, trying to give his <clears throat> understanding of something which is so well above his head. You talk, you tell Dr. Sanji, or oh, nail this grass about UFOs or astrology, they're going to laugh their head off, not realizing that the true meaning of what it means to be human and the reasons for so many uh, deadly occurrences are because of those nasty entities cursing the police humanity through the stars. I understand why they can connect with me because I'm so far-fetched being loaded with Aquarius. I belong to the future. I mean, told the future. They sign rules, not only astrology, but UFOs. And you wonder why they're running after me nonstop. My magnet will attract a piece of wood. And I'm paying the price. That's why I say it's a curse sometimes to know so much and not being hurt. And on, or worse, not being helped by people who really don't help me. Again, Policing will be so dangerous that many brave servants will quit and a number of cops getting killed or being killed, okay, or killing innocent citizens will explode in the months to come. Infected criminal and infected cops will get bolder and wilder, committing horrific crime against the police and the, and the public, something that has never ex been experienced before. You wrote my word. I mean, you read my word, words that I wrote two, three, four years ago, for God's sake. And it's happening. The idea is, see, you have links. Click on it, read, understand. Now, what really led to Ty Nichols' death? That's where it's going to get interesting, my good friend. We're going to do stars. Stand on. You're going to learn something with me today. Nichols were pulled on January 7th, pulled over. That happened during one of my deadly window, okay, by the Memphis police for reckless driving. Now, pay attention, because when I unlight something, that's where I want you to pay attention. And the confrontation occurred, uh, the department says. Okay, so why was a reckless driving, and why a confrontation take two place. Now, remember, there are no accidents in Dr. Cherry's world. I'm going to give you the answers. Something you ain't going to find with the police, police profilers, FBI, educated idiots, like scientists, psychiatrists, psychologists in high place. 
And that's why, again, you are still here watching and why my channel is growing. All right. Pay attention. The police chief says that the department has been unable to find anything that substantiates the probable cause of reckless driving. Okay. Okay. Nichols died three days after the police encounter in the hospital. Authority are yet to reveal the cause of the death of Ty, of Ty Nichols. I want to refresh your memory. That well before um, Brian Laundry case, I said he was a Scorpio. He strangled his girlfriend. He went to his house. He got a gun and he shoot his head off and his body is in the water. It's only those who have followed me on my YouTube video that they can't confirm what I said. Well the head of the coroner. I said the same thing, okay, when it came to uh, the other Brian who killed those four or five students. I said, it must be a Scorpio born in November. Well ahead of time, the first day I heard of it. And I was right, twice, and so many other times. Now, while reptilians infected cops are the main reason, okay, they don't know. They're acting robotically. They are infected by the reptilians, like the majority of people around us, okay? The reason is obvious, the cops. But, you know, the obvious can also be very deceiving because none of those cops, or the police administration for that matter, are cosmic conscious. And that's why, again, you're here. You're going to hear something different, something real. None of them read my critical warning. Be very careful of what you say or do during any of my 2023 deadly pretronic window because anything you say or do will follow you for the rest of your life. Those cops do not know. And what really upsets me is that they have access to the date of birth of that child or that criminal. They don't know if they are dealing with a true criminal, a born killer, or a normal a citizen or that is care. Okay. So it'd be easy for them to click after following my class, after following my teaching, to make the very difference between you and a killer. You have that option, Mr. Cops. Yes, you have that option to know before you get out of your trooper with your gun and scared to death, knowing and wondering if you're gonna go back home. You have that option. But your elite leaders are too religious or too skeptical. And you pay the price, and so is your family. The sad reality is mass shooting, suicide, and infected cop killing people, or each other, for that matter, will never stop. Again, unless society or and the police and the FBI start paying attention to what they may perceive as ridiculous, pure pseudoscience. Okay. Again, if you're a cop, not a cop, or leave with a cop, read, read, please. Show me a reader. I'll point out a winner and share wildly because I only have you. And to those who are skeptical, they're going to die like flies. It's written right here. God don't speak to fools. All right. We're getting to the core now. Tyre was a Gemini. Okay. Gemini is ruled by Mercury. Mercury rules every moving part. Mercury is so strong in his chart and my chart. That's why I'm a talking head. That's why I'm an ADD, ADHD. This is why I was born with tremendous amount of physical and mental energy. So was Tyre. He was a Gemini. Okay. He was always fast. I've been stopped by the cops when I was young so many times trying to contain that energy. That's not an excuse, don't get me wrong. But what makes it worse in the, in, in the case of Tai is that he's also born with the tail of the dragon on himself. Okay, that triple, quadruple, the impatience, the nervosity, the speed that he was born with. His parents did not know. Tyre did not know. His school teacher did not know who he was. He didn't know himself. It doesn't, it didn't. The teacher, Dr. Cherry, all my students are learning from me right here, right now, okay? 
They're not at school. They're not there to educate those kids to pay attention, to control. They cannot apply the will or the power of God in them. They can help them to control. So usually when you have the tail on yourself, you don't live long. That's nasty, the tail of the dragon. Unless you are fully aware and slow down, you're going to break bones. You're going to bring fingers. You're going to get stopped by the cops. Or you're going to be killed by the cops. Yeah, it's written there in light. I'm going to go explain that to you. You see, why was he so combative? Why was he always fighting? Not only because he was scared, okay? Not only because he was scared, and for good reason, when you start to beat the hell out of this poor kid. But look, Mars, the planet of war, the planet of danger, the planet of aggressivity, is in his third house, which is his mind, in the sign of Leo, okay? So this kid was combative. It's just the way God made him. It doesn't mean it has to be wrong. It could have been combative for the art, for love, for light, because Leo was love, light, France, Italy. That's why we say uh, French and Italians are romantic. It affects our language, okay? So this Mars in his mind stimulated is driving because traditionally, we always start with Aries. That's what I teach my students. One, two, three. You see, Gemini, third house, communication, transportation. Watch, one, two, three, okay? He's got Mars in the third house of transportation and communication. That means danger. Wherever Mars is, accident, gone, fire, okay? Just be cautious. Understand what I'm trying to say. Look, in this house of work and service to the world. A lot of Gemini loves to drive fast. They are the best cops you can get. They work at night, you see? Gemini. See the house of work? Wherever Pluto is, that's where death will enter your life. The sixth house is no service in the world only or uh, your health. It's also your daily habits, doing things. And Scorpio was the night. That's where he was killed at night. Pluto in Scorpio is dignified. He's quadrupling the power and the option to get killed. He could have been a doctor. He could have been a metaphysician. He could have been an FBI agent. He could have been a cop. That is the service to the world. Instead, he got killed by the very cops that he was fleeing from. Because Gemini is all about fleeing. Gemini or Mercury is the metal of Mercury. Try to grab the metal of Mercury in your hand. What's going to happen? It's going to go all over the place. You can't grab it. It's fast. So it's natural for them to run like a horse. Mercury rules a horse. What does a horse do? Run. Speed, communication, transportation. Get it. Simple. Now let's go to why he was killed. You go to the eighth house of death. There you go. It's ruled by Capricorn. What is Capricorn? The government, the structure, the police force, the FBI, anything and everything that well with the structure, principle, engineering. It's eight house of death. You see, the moon is in Capricorn. And when he died, the moon was in Cancer, which means the beginning or the end of important phases of life. This is where I lost my mother. A lot of people sad enough beginning, ending of life, that's when they go. So, my gosh, it's so obvious. And then you have Uranus, which is the sudden release of energy, which means anything can happen. It's like lightning. Uranus was lightning on the house of death. He's got bitten. And some of these cops probably had drugs and alcohol in their system. You see, Neptune is there. Who had a, he could have also have had, he goes both ways. My friend, there is so much to learn. This is just the tip of the iceberg. The tip of the iceberg, as far as my explanations are concerned. I'm currently teaching astroforensic to 13 people on Zoom, and they're all having a blast. I am sure they're going to give me a lot of good references when they are done with this class, which you will read. Okay, and you can also jump in, even if you missed the two classes that we have had already. We're starting again on Monday, okay? You can still catch up by reading the record or listening to the recorded class on the private cosmic code. Now, let's talk about something else. Watch. This is 
the window for today, okay, the 28th, yeah, okay, that's when secrets come to light, okay, now, ugly face of death, drama, horror surface, uh, the keywords are pretty obvious, police, police news, drama, this and this and that, so explain all that, look what the news are today, three people were killed and at least four were wounded in an overnight shooting in Los Angeles, bad, cops, you know, it's coming. It's not every day. You will realize it's coming more like every single day because the reptilians are running the show. And you're not aware of it, okay? A father was charged with killing his wife and son. Wait a minute here. The court released video on attack of Paul Pelosi. Again, secret comes to light. Death, drama, sex. Eight people dead in several injuries in Jerusalem in the synagogue. Religious fanatics killing each other. Russia. This window means also news from Russia. Okay, you can read all that, but pay attention to what happened to John Leno. John Leno suffers a broken collarbone, broke his rib and cracked the kneecap in a crash. Now, before that, a few weeks ago, he ended up in fire. Why? Because he's an Aries. Aries is ruled by Mars. Mars means danger, a love for bike, a love for taking chances, fire. Energy of Mars is war, danger, speeding, aggressivity. He is an Aries, and he was born with an Aries head. That's why he didn't die in both accidents. He's protected by his dragon. Okay, and if you read my 2023 Nostradamus Dragon forecast for all the sign, I said people born in October or April, that would be Leno, or those are born with a rising moon natal or hidden dragon in Aries, Leno, or the Pelasis, okay? Both of them have the tail of the dragon in Aries. Aries was the head, a hammer come in his head and crack his skull, okay? In the other sign are the target of the new red blood Martian Aries dangerous dragon coming up. It's coming up, this dragon. Get it. Get it. Be aware of where and how this dragon is going to get to you, my friend. Because in my world, there are no accidents. Now, you want to know about your own natal dragon? Put your hand on the book. Okay? Remember. Remember. Show me a reader, I point out a winner. My good friend, at that point, I don't know what to do to reach the FBI, to reach the police, or to reach society at large, to help all those teachers and all these, these school teachers and parents and realize that God don't speak to fool. God speaks through the sign at 73 on February 26, I spent all my life trying to decipher the aeroglyph of the universe. My students are having a blast because those people are you know, selected, they're special, and they're not learning from me by accident. Okay, they've been chosen. They're gonna learn and hopefully they're gonna carry on my legacy. And maybe generation of the future that will be smarter than the moronic, reptilious, infected, religious fanatics all around us, okay? Maybe those guys are going to be able to reach the FBI because as far as I'm concerned, I had it giving my pearls of wisdom, my critical and rare pearls of wisdom to what Jesus called dogs and pigs. So today I decide to put it out there, make you think of what you are missing. If you don't build your own cosmic consciousness, as much as you've been taught to respect the laws of man, stop at the red light, stop at the stop sign, the cops are going to be there to stop you. Okay, because you don't see the other hand doesn't mean it doesn't exist. There is another set of laws written in the light, astro psychology, astro forensic, okay, divine astrology. If you mess up those laws, there is a heavy penalty coming to you. And you know who's that going to be? That's going to be God himself punishing you for your ignorance, your lack of curiosity, your skepticism, or your faith, faith belief in science. Or the teaching of someone called Neil, Neil Disgras. <laughs> a rapist, <laughs> literally. Okay. What I'm trying to say is 
it's your chance to learn. You still have a chance to join this course. We're going to be going for many, many more days. Uh, just email Terania if you want to jump in, <clears throat> become one of the previous select, one of the chosen one, learn all that good stuff, and just further and promote my legacy. Now I'm going to go on the FBI website. I'm going to give them, again, another opportunity to understand what happened with their police officers. And hopefully, maybe they're going to say, okay, Dr. Chibi, maybe you have something. Now we're going to check you. We're going to behave like a real detective, okay? And then we're going to listen to you. And you're going to be teaching a little bit more about what's going on with the cops and the public. So we are. All right, my good friend. <sighs> Careful. This window is nasty. Just start it, okay? So read the newsletter. Read it again and again and again because I'm going to add the rest of the story as we move along into that window. Be safe out there. And please share my work. God bless all of you. Bye-bye.